I look like a shambles. Hello everyone, it's been a little bit of a while since I filmed anything slash post anything because I'm taking a little break because I've got this thing called a degree which is kind of just very time consuming, unexpectedly so. I was gonna do like a week in the week in the life at university kind of video but that's too restrictive because sometimes only one thing happens in a week that's like pretty cool so I think I'm just gonna vlog until the end of term. At the moment it is November November the 9th. I'm gonna hedge my bets and say that. I've got two drama essays and one English essay due in later this week, but I want to hand them in today because tomorrow evening I'm going to the Student Radio Awards at the O2 Arena. I'm meeting my friend Georgia um, at the library in like half an hour, but I'm gonna head over there now because I feel as though we might not get much work done. It's just an instinct. Before I head off, I'm just gonna do a quick uni, uni day OOTD. Oh, I hate, I hated that. Runway necklace, necklace from Penny, glasses from Specsavers, uh, earrings from Primark, the hair and gross plait that I slept in. Primark cardigan, H&M turtleneck, H&M jeans, Tesco boots, and what's that? A tiger, a tiger tote bag, a tiger tote bag. So it's now um, the end of the 9th of November, it's 2321. Didn't film anything today because I spent literally my entire day in the library. As a reward to myself for getting through these essays, I've just booked in to get another piercing. I'm the picture of health at the moment as well, I'm thriving. I need to get my essays my last essay done and handed in. I've had a bit of caffeine and it's working better than it usually does, which is crazy. So we're just gonna see where it takes me. Good morning, everybody. It's the 10th, it's the 10th. That's what I'm gonna presume. I've just woken up, it's quarter to 1 p.m. Well, I need to get ready for the Student Radio Awards. I also have my piercing at half three. I don't know what I'm getting pierced. I'm either choosing between, I don't know if I said, but I'm choosing between the helix and the second on the lobe, but I don't know which I'm doing. I need to straighten my hair. I need to do my makeup. I need to put on my jewelry and my clothes and shit. I've successfully got one half of my hair straight, I think. I may need to trim my fringe a little bit later because I've been, I've been trimming it over the last couple of days just when I see like one that's like getting into my eyeball. I've been getting rid of it. Okay, so I've now straightened as much of my hair as I physically can without carry -on's help. Oh, I look so pretty and shiny. Oh, there are some kinky bits there. That'll be Carrion's job. Ooh. It's time for a taste test slash review. I'm quite scared that they're gonna be spicy. Yeah, yeah. There's a little bit. Of, there's a little bit of a punch to that. Look who's here. It's me. <laughs> it's Carrion. <laughs> You're having a good old, good old gossip, which you're you're not allowed to know. Deal with that. Know. She know. knows. <laughs> okay. Well. Um. See, see you later. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. Welcome back. I'm ready to go. Carrion's there. Still here. I have to walk down the high street in this dress, which at three in the afternoon doesn't feel very natural. Okay, time to pee. Bye. We're officially on route. Oh, oh my god. Missing. Yay! Yes. I still don't know what I'm getting. We have just we've just got left. Seconds got seconds done. Bled a little bit. And I'm at the station ready to go to the student radio awards. And Karen's not invited. And I'm not coming because <laughs> I'm a loser. Okay, I'm saying bye now. Hello, hello, hello. It is currently the 12th of November. I'm just in between a drama seminar and an English seminar. The English seminar just finished like 10 minutes ago. It's about 1 p.m. So I'm cooking myself lunch. And by cooking, I mean putting hot water in a super noodle and eating that. Do you remember I'm going to my lecture so tomorrow. 4.21am. Twice in one night. 
Kill this carnation. <laughs> Welcome to my uni vlog. Welcome to my cooking show. Yay, it's called Reheating Pizza that was cooked for us two, an hour and a half ago. And is done. Currently. Quick yeah. story time about, about, <laughs> about the fire alarm. So, we had one at two o'clock, which was fine because we basically only just gone back to our rooms yeah. from then. Um, then we had another at 20 past four, mm -hmm. which um, you, you were pleased about. I wasn't very pleased at all. Tell the people why. Because uh, I had a nine o'clock class I had to be in person for. Yes. St I was still awake at 20 past four, so I was like, oh, we came out of our rooms, Kate's next door to me. Kate looked catatonic mm -hmm. and I went, morning! <laughs> <laughs> and then we had a third one at 40, 440, and that was just as I was about to go to sleep. Like I was on my phone in bed ready. Oh, oh, she's ready. Supper time, <laughs> bye. Ooh, ooh, there it is. I love people who can't wash up. <laughs> I really love it. Welcome back. You're balanced on a Nutella pot. Time for me to chow down. Herbie boy, fuck me, it's hot. Ah, no. Ah! I look insane at the moment. Apologies. It is Thursday, the 18th of November. I've just finished my shift at work. It is 6:02 p.m. and I ordered mozzarella sticks to go, so I'm going to eat them whilst I do the 15 minute trek back to my university accommodation and then I'm gonna reheat the leftover pizza that I had from last night which was distinctly mediocre. Whoa. I look like utter shit but I just got back from work. I managed to only eat two of the seven mozzarella sticks on the journey back. It showed great restraint. Honestly, I got five left. They're too hot, but they're fucking delicious. 3.33 a.m. the day after, I think this 18th or the 17th, I don't fucking know. After I had my own mozzarella sticks, I had a nap and then I went to these like little mini audition things which I think went pretty well and I should hear back during the day uh, once I wake up. Relax? Yeah, become like normal. Oh, okay. So like, so like, oh. <laughs> like, oh, being a goddess yeah. is so hard. Um... <laughs> Mm. It's a video. Oh. <laughs> so what are you eating, baby? I'm eating. It's like chicken pesto pasta. Wow. Mm. Wow. Really adventurous. I'm having something melted. I'm not actually sure what it is, but. I think it's tuna. <laughs> Hiya, team. I hope you're all thriving. It is 42 minutes past midnight on the 20th of November. I just wanted to give you a little end of the day update. I had my drama seminar this afternoon. At the end of the sen- mm, I have an issue saying seminar. At the end of the seminar, I checked the Instagram for this, the auditions I did last night. Five plays of roughly eight minutes each that are being put on like one after the other like next weekend and I auditioned for all five of them because it just like made sense because they're all in the same room. Shut up! I auditioned for all five of them and I got a part in in two of them which I'm really excited about. So I put up this poster, Harry Styles is naked and I'm in a blanket. That's all, goodbye. I just made the most gourmet meal ever. Just got back from work, made the most gourmet passe I've ever seen in my life. For someone probably with lactose intolerance, probably not the best idea, but it looks delicious. This bad boy was made in a microwave. Mmm, yeah. I have no idea how it tastes. No idea. Hi, it's the 21st of November, technically. Uni vlog, hi. We've just been looking at houses for- And Mamma Mia and Elton John. No, no. Oh. Houses for Elton John. Houses for Mamma Mia, yes. Oh, you're, you're in the video, but I never introduced you. Uh. <laughs> this is Kate. Hi. Or what do you keep saying? Johnny Cash. Johnny Cash. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Kieran. <laughs> I spread it. Oh. They just keep talking in Welsh, go and follow it. Fagba. <laughs> bag fa! A split of bag fa! That's the Welsh for bean bag. Oh, no, ghost of the bean bag. Ghost of the bean bag! <laughs> again! Again, it's happening again! Good morning! Oh, for fuck's sake, you're kidding! It's Sunday, Sunday. what's the date? 21st. Is that Kate? Hi! Hi. Welcome back to Cooking with Abby. We've actually done this recipe before on my channel. Get out of the way. I've accumulated two sausage rolls. Can you get my cheese out? Can you get my cheese out, please? Please, it's on the shelf. Uh, has a post-it note on it. These. Thanks. Two of your finest British sausage rolls. And you're going to need to clean your cutlery because you haven't yet. Tell them about yourself. I'm Carrie Ann. Do a segment, you two. Go on. Come hey, on, Kate. Kate. We're Kate and Carrie Ann. Oh, I'm Carrie Ann. And this is Kate. <laughs> <laughs> my toast 
I think I think nothing to three try is on. Mine. Three is three is. Oh, eight. I like a good six. Six. six? I'm, I'm between a one and a three with myself. <laughs> I'm between a one, a, one and a three. That's a two. I like I like <laughs> some. T well, I see your point. You had some housing based trauma today Very the house we wanted um it's on the website for some reason even though it's not actually available look at these bad boys so excited to eat these mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so happy to get that camera i hope so and then they converse about feminism Hell yeah. so i just had a radio board meeting got some dinner there but didn't finish it all so i'm now reheating it now back in my accommodation i'm fucking freezing i make this quick because i don't really have the time but i'm currently in the creepiest building in my entire university about to have my second rehearsal of the evening for my second little play just got myself a, like a boba coffee thing and I've, it's been a busy day busy good day i've also run out of storage good boy Hi all, I hope you're having a beautiful evening. For me currently it is 22.24 on the 27th of the 11th, 2021. That was a lot of numbers, deal with it. I just had my little play performance thing that I mentioned earlier on in the video that I auditioned for. I only had a week to do it and it was two like really short plays but I knew all of the words which I was very happy about. People seem to enjoy it. I also found out that something else I auditioned for I got which is next week and I have to know a monologue for it which is exciting but again a tad stressful. I've just been back for a little bit took a shower, I need to sort out my fringe because it's been fucking annoying all day. And I made myself a cheese toasty. Ta-da! That's the cheese spillage on top there. Oh, fuck me. I'm gonna have the cheese toasty, I'm gonna watch New Girl. I'm on season three and I started it like a couple of days ago, which is like crazy. What even is a degree? Am I right, guys? <laughs> I've got loads of Christmas events coming up, so I'm trying to be thrifty and my mum's bringing up a bunch of my old like black tie stuff, but I also still have Black Friday deals. So I'm buying a halter neck velour blue jumpsuit from H&M and I'm not even sorry about it. I am seeing all my family tomorrow, so maybe you'll get some of that. I don't know. Who cares? Good night. Hi all, I hope you're having a beautiful day. I'm going to see my family today. Last clip you will have seen was the sound of fire alarms. That was because last night, between the times of half four in the morning and about ten past five, we had six separate fire alarms. Only one went on long enough for it to be worth going downstairs. All the others were just brief and fucking annoying. But I'll give you a quick OOTD, I suppose. My usual earring combo. That one's Claire's, that one's Primark. Black turtleneck fancy trousers and my usual black trainers. I have to pee before I see my family. Okay, goodbye now. What are we doing? Yeah. We're all like <laughs> fucking zany with tiredness. <laughs> what have you been playing just now? Kniffle. Kniffle? No, it really sounds like a baked good because it sounds like souffle. I would love a Danish kniffle for breakfast, please. <laughs> No, because you always have Danish pastries for breakfast, though, don't you? Hence, oh, works. That's not. <laughs> that's fair. And now you wait. I thought we were just waiting. No, there is like a bench. No, it's just cold. No, but there is a thing. Chicken wire. Chicken wire. Do you want to do another Carrie Ann and Kate segment? It's Carrie Ann, and it's. No, I'm Carrie Ann. Yeah. Oh, I got the wrong way around. How could you forget your own name? <gasps> it's ready. It's been roughly roughly 50 minutes since our last clip, and in that and time, laundry is damp. We had it in the dryer. Kate, you know what? Kate. Just pack it in for a minute, love. <laughs> Neither of these fuckers like Robbie Williams. Baby's <laughs> first so dominoes. Nice. Yay! And the drinks. the drinks. And the electronics to watch Brooklyn Nine Nine on, because Kate. Fucking weirdo who's never seen Brooklyn Nine Nine. We've returned to Carrie Ann's room. I'm gonna show you the goods. We've got one one big ass meaty boy and one cheesy boy because somebody doesn't eat meat. We've got a, a midway game of kniffle. Which I'm winning. You don't know that. We've had one go each. I'm winning. What's the show about? Police. Police. <laughs> Thank you for that. I see. It's about cops gone rogue. <laughs> <laughs> Why, Grandma? What big ears you have! <laughs> oh, that's it. Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot what you do with ears. <laughs>
Hi team, me again. It is 5 to 4 p.m. on the 1st of December, baby, best month. I just had a little drama thing. We were meant to perform a selection of Scratch Theatre to an audience, but because of the new COVID variant, it meant that we weren't actually allowed an audience for this one, which is fucking annoying. But um, I did just film it. I did a a monologue based on Diana and Actian. Good evening, everyone. It is okay. like the 2nd of December. We're outside eating cake after a little improv show and we're gonna watch the Christmas. Like, thank you so much, I was in it. Oh, Christmas music. Christmas. Um, Christmas. And we're gonna watch the lights go on and you might see that or you might not because I like to live in the moment. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, yeah. Yay. Comedy gold. Wow. Wow. Hello everyone and welcome back. It's been a little bit of a minute since my last clip because um, I ran out of storage and I've had to be working around that. But I'm dedicated to this shit so I'm coming back at you with a quick update. It is 6.55pm on the 6th of December. I have a night out this evening because nights out at my university happen on a Monday and it's the last official Monday night out of the year, hence why it's Christmas themed. Hence why the only Christmas themed thing I can do is red and also a Santa hat that I got from a Christmas dinner two days ago, yesterday. Oh my god, it was yesterday, fog. And I have an English deadline on the 8th, I have a drama deadline on the 10th, and then I have another drama deadline on the 16th. Um, I'm staying at my university until the 16th. I now kind of look like Lord Farquaad, okay. I have an improv performance tomorrow night, which is really exciting, I'm really looking forward to it. I also found out I got the position of assistant director for our main term improvised show, which is exciting because I actually really, really, really want to do it. Oh, and I'm going to the Performing Arts Ball on Thursday, which I did that about because it's the day before my drama device performance, but it's first year, so who cares? I'm wearing my sister's dress that I stole many years ago. I wore for my year 10 Christmas dinner at school and it fits me better now than it did then. 11 o'clock, guys. <laughs> to 11. Hello. We're having a great time. Carrie has had less than me and she's more fucked than I am. Yeah. Hi all, it's the 8th. My hair is drying poorly. It's been a while since I did anything in here, but we got Domino's again and I'm gonna show you. Here it is. One little veggie boy and one stuffed crust cheesy boy. Hiya pals, it's the, ah, it's the 10th of December. I'm wearing a jumper that I got from H&M last weekend, I think. Um, I love it. I love it so much. It makes me so happy. Shout out to Zoe for finding it in the shop. Brings me so much joy. It's got a butterfly on it. And today is meant to be the day where I do my first drama devised performance, but three fifths of the group that I am have fevers. So my group are sort of in turmoil. Yesterday I had the performing arts ball, which was good fun. I'm still going to watch the other performances because I'm a supportive person. Also, I'm one of only two people in my group who are actually well. I also just got my first Christmas present, which was from my lovely friend Benny. I will grab it and show you. A big old block of cheese, some smoky redwood. I'm excited to try that out. Two little, two little macaroons. Macarons, macaroons. Some crackers to go with the cheese. And my throat really hurts and I have a tension headache because I sleep with my jaw clenched nowadays because I'm that anxious all the time. Yay, this is what uni is really like. The title of this video doesn't lie. This is Ruba. <laughs> She's been featured before in the dancing clips. That was early on in the seminar drama trauma. Now we're right at the very end, <laughs> at the most traumatic part. Is this the end though? It's never gonna end. <laughs> Is this to be continued? We're gonna be doing this till we die. <laughs> Our first fucking drama module and it's never gonna be over. <laughs> but basically, we're the only two people in our group without fevers. Um, so we can't perform. <laughs> our group started with six. It's just falling apart repeatedly. Yeah. Began with six. Two left. <laughs> Who will be the <laughs> last one standing, I imagine? Rah. Thank just you. Proven that our immune systems are just elite. Are just stronger. Yeah. We're Survival just built different. <laughs> it's but so funny because we are the most sleep deprived and mm. we should be the ones who are collapsed. Yeah. N neither of us have slept in the last no. month. I just want to pinch this person's head. <laughs> Our seminar leader, I'm not saying your name, has been very helpful. Or you'd be glad, honey. <laughs> gonna have to put like a quack over it. <laughs> quack. She's doing quack sounds. She's been pretty helpful and quite amenable, considering that everything's fallen apart in like the last yeah. 24 hours. Um, it's been probably a little longer than 24 hours. Well, our whole group has been splintering <laughs> since the very beginning. We've had one seminar with all of us there. Yeah. One probably like in a two term. rehearsals. Was everyone there? But I, like, I think everyone that's has been late. Either people have been late or ill or depressed or all of the above. <laughs> I'm 
so in conclusion, we're both dropping drama and we're just doing English degrees now. Single on us. I refuse. I would actually rather drop out, to be honest. We become what that's what we despise, is it not? Yes. You have become what you hate the most. A single honors student. I'm gonna pinch this person's head again. I don't know. Oh, oh, she's going away. Oh. <laughs> I would say good morning, but that would hardly be accurate because it's gone 2 p.m. It's the 11th of December and I feel horrific. I woke up at 9 because the plan today was that I was going to go to London with my friends, but um, I woke up and I felt so awful that I literally like, I was like, just go without me, there's no point. I have a congested nose, I cough, my throat hurts so much and if you like just gently tap my neck. It feels like I'm being punched in the throat. But I just woke up again. And my lovely, lovely friends have <laughs> left just like a care package of friendly, friendly ill pack outside my room. Zoe and Kate left me ibuprofen, two ice creams, a lem sip, and some, <laughs> some multi-purpose wipes in case I touch anything. I'm excited to try these um, vegan magnums. Quite scared they're gonna be really melted because they left two hours ago and I've, they've just been sitting outside my room, but I'm gonna eat one now. It's melted. I'm not surprised, but it doesn't taste too bad. Fun way to bookend my first term. Started it ill for three and a half weeks and now I'm ending it ill. If there are any more clips in this vlog, lucky you. Since my last clip, I took a shower and I did a lateral flow test, which is negative, thankfully. Since I'm not in London at the moment, I'm gonna run a few errands that I need to do, which includes buying 800 packets of soothers. I'll quickly show you my ill OOTD. <laughs> Billie Eilish H&M t-shirt, my favorite, favorite jeans from Primark, a secondhand thrifted jacket thing, my favorite necklace ever, which was given to me by Penny, gold studs in my second, this bag. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Woo! It's the campus cap. What have you found? Attack, go. Go! It's December and I'm wearing a vest top. I've had a lovely day. Um, Karen was in my room until 6.15 yesterday morning, just like gossiping and shit. We decided to go for brunch and it was the best idea ever. It was really nice. It was so good. I very much enjoyed myself. It was very worth it. When they were ringing up our order, they accidentally ch nearly charged us £46. And we were like, we were like um, <laughs> that's not <laughs> quite right. We were at breakfast, breakfast, mm. lunch. At, we were there for a couple of hours. Until like two? Yeah, until recently. And now we've just been walking around campus having a lovely, lovely little jaunt, if yes, you will. Yes, a little jaunt. The main topic of our conversation last night the reason why Karen came to my room at one and then stayed until six did the bold thing and I asked a boy out via Instagram. I'm not going to say his name. Very proud, very proud. Very proud. And we were walking out of the brunch and we were coming up the hill back to our accommodation and at a fucking crossroads, this red car pulls up and then the fucking boy who I asked out last night is in the car. So I'm like, he's there. Right. I, I look away because I'm like, there's no way I'm engaging with this. But then this. I look, obviously, because... Because <laughs> Karen has nothing to lose. <laughs> oh, so, ooh, is that, is that... He looks at Abby. I can see him, like, because he's driving there. You know when you just see somebody's turning around? Mm. And mm. he was just, he was looking, he was just having a little quick peek. Mm -hmm. Nice you for sure. For sure. For sure. <laughs> it was just a funny turn of events, like, of all the roads, of all the places. Of all the times. Of all the times of day, like... You just happened to be there while we were crossing the road like what the fuck so weird so we, we strange just, he's been the main topic of conversation For manifestation is a thing it's real i'm a witch mm. essentially you really I are. am a witch you really are one of my last clips was me disgustingly ill that was yesterday i didn't go to london i still feel disgusting now but like not to the same extent like i'm able to at least like move and eat but it hurts when i swallow or like breathe we're very nearing the end of our term and my voice is going again Oh, I sound Started sexy. Started term with their voice, ending, ending term, term with their voice. voice. That's basically it, nothing much, nothing much else. Nothing much else to report. Oh, I did mention the blue jumpsuit really early on in this video. It arrived and it didn't fit. It was quite sad. It was really sad. It mm. fit really well on the bottom. I look very pale. Oh, look at that. Jeez. That's from pulling pints, baby. Oh, I'm ripped. Absolutely shredded. Completely. I only I have mean, muscles in my arms. I gym every single day. <laughs> my gym is the pub.
She's getting really frustrated with me doing this all the time. Yeah, as well. I'm fucking beat your ass. Every little fucking photo <laughs> I take of her, I'm like, I'm going to beat this out of you. You're no. gonna stop doing the awkward no, peace sign. It's... I'll be in a photo with Carrie Ann, Kate, and Zoe, and all of them do it, all three of them, and I'm like, for the love of God, please stop doing the awkward peace sign. I'm sorry, I can't yeah. get rid of it without getting rid of peace myself. A piece of yourself. <laughs> hey, nice. Good one. It Hi. might be your last clip in this video. Oh no, that be last clip. <laughs> <You're> just... <laughs> Hi kids, we're so hot. It's the 12th of December. We are microwaving some burgers. Bitch. Coward bitch. Okay, that's all. Bye. Bye. I love you. <laughs> Hi all, just jumping in here as a voiceover to explain what the fuck is going on in these clips. Basically, on the 14th of December, I had to call an ambulance for myself because I couldn't breathe, eat, sleep, talk, um, do any of that good shit. Um, and then I had to go to hospital. I spent two nights there. I ended up with glandular fever. And this is me leaving. This final clip is me standing by the side of the road with my dad on the way home from the hospital because our front tyre disintegrated and this was us waiting for the AA. Merry Christmas.